Hi and welcome to my channel. It's me Tina. I am here to do a flip through of this journal um, that I've made. I made the cover uh, with you guys while well, actually decorating the cover and I added the word journal here and uh, then I added this uh, purple uh, spine thing here. Um, I may be adding a um, dangle here yet. I forgot to do that, but I'll go find one. Um, yeah, so this was um, coffee dyed, uh, stenciled, splattered, um, what else? I don't know. Lots of stuff done to it. Uh, sewn journal. Um, it's got lots of new... Um, pockets in it that I've been trying out. Uh, I've seen other people do, so I've been trying them. And this beautiful lace, it's got um, two layers. I've got eyelets here for the um, closure. And this beautiful flower with the bling. I think it is absolutely gorgeous. And yeah, let's dive right in. So, um, here are a few uh, things in the pocket. This is from Graphic 45. Friendship is slow ripening fruit. Yes, it is. And then this one is a bird with a birdhouse, a bird. And then I've got a little stamp. Colored flowers and hello. And then this is, I'm not sure what digital this is. Um, I just had this in my stash and didn't want to throw it out. Um, I've seen people working with this, but I am not sure what uh, what digital that is from. So here is um, a pocket that opens up like this, and it opens up like this, and I have little beautiful journaling cards in there. And there is, you can have put pictures in here or do journaling. And even on the back here, you can do journaling. And uh, did I put something? Oh, yeah, I put something in here, a big journaling card. There we go. Isn't that pretty? I think I saw Corey Dahlman do this. And I just thought it was beautiful. And then here is just a uh, journaling spot. You open it up and you have any, another journaling card in here. So there's lots of room for journaling, for pictures in here. And then you have a little booklet here. You open it up this way. You can open it up that way. And then you open it up this way. And this is an envelope. And I just stuck some uh, journaling card in there. And you can journal under here. And you can tuck this over and make it a little secret pocket so nobody knows that it's there. And this is just some inked paper. And then I have a little pocket here with a little card. And then you open it up, and here is a little uh, notebook you can use, and it says Cherish. You can tuck it in this way, or you can tuck it in this, this way. I think this is the way I had it, like this. Ooh. Yeah take things out and you can never put them back. There we go. And this is done in such a way that it's a really flat little notebook. So yeah, I think I like it like this. There we go. And then this is a little pocket here with beautiful lace and a flower. And you can pull this out and do some journaling there. And some stenciling some more of that beautiful paper and um, I've sewn two pages together so each page has the sewing and this is just coffee dyed paper 
here is a uh, what is that mm, whatever that is here is part of an envelope and some more of that beautiful paper and here is coffee dyed paper no this is uh, inked paper with a pocket and then I've got a uh, card in here coffee backed or coffee paper backed and it says life doesn't have to be perfect to be wonderful and I love that here's some lined paper coffee dyed and here is a belly band and I believe this was also an idea from Corey Dahlman um, it's got a little ticket in here and then it opens up and you can do journaling in there um, you can take this out and I put a vintage postcard in here um, rough sea I don't know Tigmouth postcard I can't read what it says there but that's a vintage postcard and then you can put this back in here and then here I did some stenciling and this is um, die cuts all around the pages graph paper and here's just some more beautiful paper another beautiful tag that wants to stay in lots of lace and sewing throughout the book and here is a uh, hidden paper clip with Tim Holtz ladies and it says friendship there with a metal piece with die cuts and lace and on the other side a butterfly and some more lace and ribbon and it just goes over the page like so there we go and then here is a cute writing page and here is a uh, flip out it's uh, got a die cut covering it with the heart and here is lots of room for journaling here is an inked page another inked page and then here is a little pocket from an envelope that uh, Carleen Gilpin made me and I'll just leave that in there isn't this beautiful oh she did a gorgeous job I love it some lined paper and here is a pocket with beautiful lace on it and this is uh, the uh, leftover from die cuts and I glued some paper on it just makes a beautiful uh, journaling card and then here is another pocket with a vintage photo on it and some more writing paper some more inked paper and some more of that paper and here is a beautiful uh, tag that I made sewn and then this says beautiful wishes and then you can pull this up for some more uh, journaling and my inked paper I love this paper oh my goodness I love it and then here is another pocket it's got own our own little world and it's got one of these little girls on it a die cut some handmade flowers that I made and that goes in there and then I have a little specimen card here and there are more pockets in here that you could fill like this but I didn't want to make it too bulky there we go there's that and then here's uh, three little pockets, actually four. You can put a big journaling card in there. See, I lost it even. <laughs> Come on. So you can put a journaling card here, here. And these are Graphic 45 cards right there. And another uh 
ink dyed page that I have here and then here is a little pocket it's got a little window when you remove the uh, the tag it goes empty and it says family forever and I just love the way that turned out some flowers it's gorgeous and yeah here's some more of that paper some graph paper here's another different little pocket with um, tags in it and I've got two little tags in the bottom there again you can add more things to it if you want and then I can't stick it back in okay let's see if that'll work there we go and this is stenciled paper in the background more stencil paper, coffee dyed paper, and I've got a couple of pockets here. Look at the little girls, the sisters. I just love it. And then I've got this page here, or this card here for journaling. And this is a die cut, and I glued some bling on it. And another die cut with some lace. More beautiful paper. And some journaling there with a beautiful pot of flowers. And it's got a uh, bigger pocket here with a journaling card. With some Tim Holtz ladies that I colored. Colored their dresses. And there we go. And here's some more of that. I think this is wax paper. That's what this is. And then here is a, another little booklet. It's kind of like a belly band. It holds this card that goes in here. And then this opens up here. And we have a tag there, a journaling spot, and some little pages here, and a couple of little tags in here. Goes like that, and you close it up. And it holds it shut like that. Very cute. And then here are some die cut birds. Uh, wallpaper flower. The branch is a die cut. It says growing. True love. Cherish. And then we have another re reminisce card it says. And it just slips in there. And here we have a little envelope that I just clipped on with a, um, a little uh, paper clip. And it comes out like this. And you can, oh, I have nothing in there, but you can put something in there. I love you because, isn't she darling? Oh, I love her. She's so cute. And then this little paper clip goes on there and it holds it in and then you can stick something on there it makes a pocket and then I have this cool little pocket that I made with uh, envelopes there's a tag in here that you can journal on and one in here and they have little windows and then one in here and then I put little die cut flowers on here and here is just a beautiful page and here is like a library card and I'm going to put my name there and there's the last page and here is another large journaling card there we go that is that there's the back um, this is for sale. Let me know if you're interested. Uh, leave a comment. Or actually, um, I will leave my email so you can email me if you're interested. And this journal is uh, $35. I think that's a fair price. Let me know if you're interested and we'll talk to you soon. God bless. Bye.